Hello everyone. NIO hints at a Mercedes partnership, flaunts tech and a 1,000 kilometers journey. Expect groundbreaking announcements at the upcoming NIO day. We haven't heard anything about the Mercedes deal so far. What's happening with it? The CEO mentioned on the 14th that we have yet to receive updates. We have also entered into an agreement with another car company for battery swapping. The announcement of these partnerships will be made one by one. This implies that they have many things that are not yet known to you or others. The CEO mentioned that there is a long line of auto companies waiting to sign deals with NIO, especially because battery swapping is a technologically complex matter. There is a bright future for this, and we will announce these partnerships one by one. Mainly, it's because they have a lot that they are not announcing yet. NIO has started a live stream of a 1,000-kilometer journey. The CEO and some senior management are in the ET7, equipped with a 150 kilowatt hour battery pack, and they are on a 1,000 kilometer road trip from Shanghai to Fusion. The journey, recorded for over 12 hours, is quite remarkable. The car itself shows impressive performance, covering almost 13 kilometers on one kilowatt hour, and they have covered nearly 700 kilometers with around 30% battery remaining. It's an impressive battery pack with good performance. However, they are quite busy. After this, they have NIO Day, where they will launch many new products. If they launch the new car, ET9, and 150 together with killer range, specs, and acceleration, introducing revolutionary aspects that could change the entire auto industry, it would be significant. It seems like they are preparing everything for an explosive day at NIO Day. This is quite a big deal. So far, we have seen Chang'an and Geely as official design partners. Additionally, there are other companies like Intox, Porsche, and Mercedes. We've heard that Rising Auto might also use NIO battery swap technology. This is SAIC, working to consolidate some matters with Mercedes. Some people wonder why this isn't happening yet. I'm telling you, some sales reps are already happy. They are expressing their joy online claiming that Mercedes is the next partner for NIO battery swap. They are posting this in advance. I can't say how much these reps are boosting sales, but it's not a lie. Discussions are ongoing. Has it already been signed? It's possible. Is Mercedes the partner that signed on the 14th? Probably not. But you know, there's more to come. Okay, another thing is that until these announcements come, I expect them after NIO Day because they have a lot on their plate right now. And perhaps during NIO Day, if there's a significant partnership. So I'm thinking after NIO Day. And another cool thing is that on NIO Day, they will also launch Gen 4 swap stations. This will be a big game changer. These Gen 4 swap stations are called public swap stations accessible to everyone. Maybe they'll have more battery capacity and faster swapping times. But we'll see. The CEO mentioned that on the 14th, they signed a deal with another new partner. But what else could happen? Absolutely anything. They're not just revealing everything to people. And it's interesting how they announced it. Like in a Q&A session, someone asked about these partnerships. And the CEO casually responded. Very casually. The truth is quite shocking. Normally, people would think this is something big and deserves a major announcement. This is very interesting because he is completely indifferent about it, and he tells people that a line of car companies is standing that wants to use it, so I won't have much impact on it. And this is quite interesting because we are on the cusp of NIO, which is essentially becoming a standardized version of gas stations, but for battery swapping. So this will be quite interesting. What's great is that NIO is doing all this, as the CEO of NIO has basically said, we are just providing the configuration of our sub-brand battery pack and swapping mechanism, then anyone can build around it. It's a bit of a package. You give it to someone, and they can build whatever they want around it. This is quite good. And they have made it quite easy for other auto companies to incorporate the NIO swapping mechanism into their vehicles, depending on their design. This is amazing. And they don't have to worry about batteries. They just have to think about design, motors, interior, and everything else. Battery charging and swapping can be done in this way. So it will be quite easy for partners to make their EV 
because everything is already done. The car configuration is largely ready beforehand. They just have to make everything else. They only make the dust of the car, which is quite good. And they have also said that working with the things they provide is not difficult for the partners so far. So this is a very good starter package that is being given to everyone, and they can just build cars around it, which is quite interesting. And an important thing to remember, NIO is selling them the battery pack. They charge money to use NIO patents, and they also charge money for the battery pack they are selling. Payment is made twice before reaching the battery swap station, which is quite surprising. So in the future, NIO has many ways to make money. As the CEO mentioned in his message to investors, I cannot confirm whether you have heard that statement or not. If you haven't, I strongly encourage you to listen to it. He suggested that it's crucial to assess not just where things stand today, but also where they are headed. He urged everyone to adopt a long-term perspective and support the vision if it aligns with their beliefs. In my opinion, you are well aware of the direction things are heading, and it's truly remarkable. This initiative is self-propelling, and when others embrace it, it becomes a thoughtful decision. You can either attempt to establish numerous swap stations independently, incurring substantial costs, or simply join the NIO swap network, which is undoubtedly the easier option. The pertinent question here is that many misconceptions still persist. Some individuals mistakenly believe that NIO can only swap batteries and cannot be charged, which is indeed absurd. There's also a misconception that swapping is inferior to charging. However, with NIO, you have the flexibility to both charge and swap batteries. The debate ends here. It's not a binary choice of either charging or swapping. You can do both. At this point, the CEO emphasized that this is precisely where a significant misunderstanding lies, which is quite foolish. Furthermore, when comparing NIO to other automotive companies, it's noteworthy that NIO holds over 7,000 patents a remarkable achievement. The existence of these patents means that others cannot engage in similar work without breaking these patents and essentially paying for it. This makes it challenging for anyone to enter the battery swap game without using NIO patents, possibly requiring compensation to utilize them. Therefore, why not simply join NIO? Joining NIO would be much easier than attempting to do everything independently. There are still many misconceptions. Some claim that NIO vehicles are now competing with taxes for batteries. However, this is not the case. And here are those Ubers, those Uber cars, and they call them virtual, which is quite amusing because NIO has said that there will be a network where everyone can swap, and then there will be a private network just for NIO. And yes, this statement might hold true at some public swap stations where everyone can go and swap, but most of the private stations belong to NIO. You won't find any hassle for this type of battery, and when you look at the new swap stations, they can hold a lot of batteries, up to 20, so you really won't see a situation where there are no batteries. So they have a lot of deals coming their way. In the future, they will have even more partners. I am sure that every car company is now looking at NIO for their business. And after NIO Day, NIO will get even more buzz and media attention because of the upcoming products they are launching. It's really going to be something special. Everyone will talk about NIO, and everyone will talk about battery swapping. This is really going to be something amazing. Thank you for joining us today. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more stock predictions and market insights. Remember to turn on the notification bell so you never miss an update. Happy investing and see you in the next video.